hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Coffee here. And today we're back with a unboxing. Yes. Now this unboxing obviously is a Diamond Art Club, but it did not come from Diamond Art Club. This one actually came from a subscriber. So thank you to that subscriber. You know who you are. They choose to remain anonymous. It was a random act of kindness. So I cannot thank you enough. Thank you so, so much. With that said, this is one of Diamond Art Club's mystery kits. And if you do not know about Diamond Art Club mystery kits, they are a limited edition, meaning if you don't get them before they sell out, you will never get them. Well, unless you get it from a destashing site. But the, the subscriber was nice enough to grab this for me because they knew I wanted this kit, but something happened around that time where I wasn't able to get it. I think I got sick or something and I forgot. So they went ahead and grabbed one for me. So again, huge thank you because this is by one of my favorite artists who is Inez Guerrero. Yes. Now I told you guys I would be unboxing this a little bit ago and I do apologize, but you know, being sick and stuff. So 50.8 by 63.7 is the size of this kit. And we're going to go ahead and get into this. I will not be starting this one immediately, but I will at some point complete this one because, oh my God, I love Inos Guerrero's mystery kits. Now, I already know what this kit is. I've already seen the kit completed and it looks absolutely fantastic. I will not be giving any spoilers as to what this kit is. I will be showing the canvas, but I will not tell you what canvas it is. If you do know which kit or which diamond painting this is, please refrain from putting it in the comment section as we don't want to ruin the mystery for anybody else. So I would have to ask that you don't do that. If you are hard-headed and decided to do it anyways, I will delete your comments. So thank you for those folks who can follow directions. So we have our toolkit and we're going to see what we got in our toolkit. I'm hoping we get a black pen with this one. We did not. We got pink. Huh. Where's Wolfpack at? Wolfpack Diamond Painting loves her pink. And we got a pink pen and a pink squishy in there. And this is a square kit. So you're going to get a pair of tweezers. Please remember to keep them sheathed so you don't shank yourself. All right. And we're going to pull out the rest of the contents of this kit here. Oh, my God. Y'all, look at this cover minder. Isn't it adorable? Oh, my God. Look at it. That is so cute. And, of course, we have our washi tape to match. Oh my God, you guys, how cute is that? Not exactly something I was expecting in a dark mystery kit, but I'll take it because, oh my God, it's so cute. I love it. So you're also going to get your seven place or your four place or your squishy, your couple of plates of wax and your heart shaped canister, your clear boat with the stopper. So that is what comes in a Diamond Art Club tool kit. So we're going to throw everything back in here. You also are going to get baggies and, of course, your pen and tweezers. If you get a square, if you get a round kit, you will not see the tweezers. So I don't care about that tool kit. Where's my little sticker at? We have the little sticker that goes on the side so that we know what it is when we put it away. So we're going to put this right here on the side. Now, even though my DP Mojo has escaped me, um, I'm sure at some point it'll come back. This happens when it comes to diamond paintings or crafting in general, you'll lose your mojo for one thing, get interest in another thing, and then your mojo will come back after a few months or so. But I do still diamond paint, so don't, don't, don't freak out. So we have that letter from Diamond Art Club asking you to keep the mystery alive by not revealing what it is. So you do not want to post these in their VIP group or anything like that because you'll get yourself in trouble, okay? And you don't want to be in trouble with DAC. Not being able to buy their kits is kind of, it, it kind of sucks, so. We're not going to be posting this anywhere. If you do want to see it, I will have it up in my Discord and stuff when I do start working on it. Because, again, I will not be working on it immediately. That purple paper that Becky loves oh so much. We have our schematic that tells us how many colors come in this kit. And it's stuck to the paper. Looks like we have, holy shnikes, 49 colors. And do keep in mind, this is a mystery kit. So there will be no colors on your legend. There's that little guy hiding in the toilet that I love so much. So, 49 colors. Good God. I can't wait to see what this one is. I think the last one I did had 50 colors, so I'm not sure. Now, I have not seen the canvas without the drills on it. I've only ever seen this kit completed, so I'm interested to see what it looks like to see if I can actually see it. With being colorblind, stuff like this kind of gives me an outline, almost like 3D, as to what it looks like. Yep, I can see it. All right, this is going to be freaking stunning. To you, it looks like absolutely nothing, which is great because you don't need to know what it is. So we're going to throw some stuff on it just so you can't keep, you know, whatever. So, our drills. Which we're going to see what kind of colors we have in this kit. So let's go through some colors, shall we? Now I'm still getting over my cold, so we're going to be reading these a little bit slower than normal. So 3864, 
double trouble there, 3790, 310 double trouble there, triple threat, quadruplets. So we have 640. We have, by the way, we have four bags of 310. 640, 842, double trouble there, triple threat. Let's go. 543, 3861, 840, 647, 3781, 648. Is this two strings or one? It's one string. All right. Let's start from the fat end. 3371, 841, double trouble there. 938, 451, 898, 3772, 3021, double trouble there. 498, 839, 844, 645, 646, 902, 3787, 640, I'm sorry, 632, 535, 433, 453, 452, 610, 355, 3830, 433, 712, eh, eh, AB alert. Yes. So your first AB in this kit is going to be numbers 141. That is a white AB. And if you're new to diamond painting, you don't know what AB is. Don't worry, Miss Coffee got you. AB stands for Aurora Borealis. It's an iridescent coating that is put onto the drills to make them sparkle just a little bit brighter. When you lay them down on your canvas, it will pick up the light from the drill next to it and make it sparkle brighter as well. Because if one shines, we all shine, you heard? So 141 is the next A or the first AB that we found in this kit. Let's see if we can find any more. And eh, eh, right next to it, 109. We have like this gray tone, maybe grayish brown color. 109 is the next AB in this kit so so far i'm seeing two ab's in this kit so let's keep going so 356 3860 300 3064 642 3726 and ab alert we have three ab's good god so we have 141 109 and 115 as our ab's in this kit so we're going to keep going 223 6476 3022, 413, 3778, and 729. All right. So we're going to do a little movie magic to get these back in their plastic. Are you ready? All right. And there you have it. Now, normally this would be the time where I would show you where the ABs go. But because this is a mystery kit, I will not be doing a close-up of the kit to keep the mystery of the kit. So if you would like to know where the ABs are, you will have to look for it in one of the DP uh, reveal groups. Or see if you can find a picture of it online somewhere. But this is the mystery kit. And I did have a bag of busted drills. Right as I was putting them away, I noticed that some of the drills had come out of one of the bags. No worries. Just a heads up, though, for those folks who are new to Diamond Art Club. If you do get a secondhand kit, meaning you did not buy it directly from their website, that voids all warranty with DAC, meaning you cannot... Um, take advantage of their uh, lifetime guarantee on the kit itself um, just because you got it secondhand and because it's passed by so many hands they can't guarantee that something didn't happen due to the, the fault of the person versus their product so they do not hold their warranties if you get this secondhand meaning since this was a gift if I'm missing drills I will have to go to another canvas to get drills or I will have to buy more drills. I have enough diamond art clubs to know that I'm pretty sure I have every color in their DMC cold list. So if I have any problems with the drills, I can make sure I can just go back into my stash to get the drills that I need. But with that said, again, thank you to the anonymous subscriber that sent this out to me. This was a kit that I was really, really excited about, and I'm happy to have my hands on it. Again, I will not be starting it immediately. I do apologize for those who would like to see that, but Unfortunately, that's not something that I can do just due to the fact of time restraints and everything else that I have going on. So if you would like to see this in the future being worked on, I will be working on it in the future. I want to be in a good mindset when I work on this. And right now being sick, I'm not in the best mindset. So with that said, thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any other questions, comments, concerns about this kit, please leave them down in the comment section below. Do keep in mind again that if you are someone who knows what this kit looks like, working on this kit or what have you, please do not reveal that in the comment section. Your comment will be immediately deleted. So please don't do that. Just follow directions, y'all. Uh, thank you again so much for watching this unboxing. And with that said, I must now bid you adieu. But not before reminding you that it's hard out here in these crafty streets. So please remember to stay caffeinated, stay crafty, stay safe. And remember, be kind to others because you never know what somebody else is going through. Be courteous because it's the right thing to do. And always stay cool. Bye, guys.